five minutes for us? Here we go. First off, yes, I am wearing my Josh Sunquist We Should Hang Out Sometime sweater because it's awesome and super snuggly. Second, we are gonna be talking about popularity today. So to start this all off, I asked you guys about your thoughts on popularity. It was just really cool to see what you guys had to say because I know this is something that I've definitely dealt with when I was growing up. I was not by any means cool. In middle school, I feel like a lot of people are going through that awkward transition in their life. And then when you get into high school, popularity becomes this big thing. I definitely was not the best person all the time. And I started hanging out with people that weren't bad people, but they just weren't, you know, the 100% best fit for me as far as friends go. And there's nothing wrong with them. It's just when I really think about it in retrospect, we didn't click in the way that I click with my friends now. It's so easy to just get distracted by what other people are doing and other people's interests and you want to fit in. I feel like that sense of belonging is in a lot of us. Even if you're not somebody that's necessarily concerned with popularity, you still want to feel comfortable with people that you're around and that to me is a sense of belonging. I've definitely had experiences where I kind of lost myself along the way because I got really caught up in what everyone else was doing and what other people were thinking of me. As I've talked to people in my life now, I realize that I'm not the only person that's been through this experience. Sometimes you lose really great people in your life and sometimes there are people that come into your life that aren't the best fit. But at the same time, that doesn't mean that great people can't ever come back into your life. It's just kind of realizing where you are right now and you know what your interests are and what you believe in and maybe just sit down and have a conversation with the people that you're hanging out with or just re-examine your situation and think is this really you know the place that i should be in even though there are friendships that i've lost that i wish i hadn't lost and there are other friendships that i've had that weren't the best fit for me it was all a learning experience so now i feel like i'm on the right path and i am with people that i really love and that i really enjoy being around i remember tweeting this a while ago sometimes i feel like life is just one big popularity contest and that makes me kind of sad actually really sad and i got so many responses to that tweet and that's kind of what stemmed this whole talk on popularity and there was one tweet from one viewer that really sunk in and hit home for me and just completely changed my outlook on everything she told me the key is to just not put yourself in the game remove yourself from the game and everything changes. And she didn't know the context of any of my personal situations, but that I feel like hit home for me and I feel like that's something that can hit home for a lot of people. It's so easy to get caught up in the game, whatever that game is for you, because you wanna do well, you wanna make people that you love happy. But at the end of the day, it's your life that you're living. You're not living anyone else's life. And you have to do what's joyful and fulfilling for for you even if it's not necessarily you know popular in other people's worlds if you are struggling to find this place where you belong you're not alone i am there with you and it's something that constantly evolves throughout your life that's something that i'm learning right now these are things that you can learn from that you can cherish that you can look back on and remember and smile or look back on and think what the heck it's a part of life and it's okay to make mistakes and it's okay to feel awesome too. So I'm just gonna leave it there for today and let that marinate. And next week we are gonna be talking about passive aggressiveness. So this is something that you can either do to someone or you can experience coming back from someone else or maybe you're both being passive aggressive. Is this something that you experience? Is it something that you're dealing with? Is it something that you're trying to overcome yourself? I want to know your thoughts. So make sure you leave your comments down below or you can tweet on Twitter using the hashtag 5MFU to join the conversation and see what other people have to say. But until next week, I will keep wearing this sweatshirt 
every single day and it might get a little smelly, but I really do wear it every single day. I sleep in it, so there's that. Now you know that fun fact. Okay, bye guys. <laughs>